To commission the system, the flow rates of each loop should be set according to the commissioning sheet contained in the design specification. This can only be done with the heating timed on and all thermostats calling for heat. In this state, all actuator heads will be opened, allowing water to flow through all flow meters. To vary the flow rate, first push the white plastic lock shield collar down to reveal a black hexagonal nut. Then turning this nut until the required flow rate is indicated by the red marker within the flow meter. This process should be repeated for all flow meters. If for any reason one of the loops needs to be isolated, this can be achieved by pulling the lock shield collar up and then turning fully clockwise. This action will fully close the flow meter and prevent any water from circulating through the loop. To reopen, just turn counterclockwise. If the white plastic lock shield collar is removed, it can be seen that the flow meter consists of two parts that turn independent of each other. The top part, once turned clockwise, will reduce the flow rate, while the bottom part, once turned clockwise, will close the flow meter. The flow meters come supplied in the fully closed position, with the flow rates set halfway. The lock shield collar, once pushed down and turned, will only turn the bottom part, but when pulled up, will turn both at the same time.